Hey everybody, what's up? Coming back at you. This time we're going to be doing a video on my Wyndham Weaponry 20 inch government model. This is the closest I'll ever own to a M16A4, I can tell you that much. Um, we got, like I said, we got the 20 inch chrome line barrel here, covered up by the uh, Midwest Industries uh, rail. I got the Knight's Armament covers on there but it is just the midwest industries because the m5 ras is just about impossible to find right now it kind of sucks but i like that everybody's getting into the retro stuff i like to see it so i won't complain too much i got typical uh vertical grip the broom handle style a non-f marked front sight post which means it's just slightly lower in a mil spec and in return the carry handle that you get with these is also slightly uh, lower so keep that in mind um the bird cage flash suppressor and as you can see i got this uh painted this is just a krylon job got the uid sticker there a little message to the elm alphabet boys if they ever get their mitts on my musket rocking the aim point on there co-witnessed with the magpole back sight i like to keep it on that larger aperture which helps me get nice fast target acquisition when uh combined with the red dot and uh it's just the bees knees highly recommend it standard a2 fixed stock on these uh, government models which is the longer length of pull if you prefer a shorter length of pull, I would recommend an A1 stock. We have the uh, standard grip on there. I think that's a A2 grip, if I'm not mistaken. Um, all these these different models, these grips, it's hard to keep track of. Uh, you get one mag with your Wyndham weaponry. I ended up getting two because I bought one that was on the floor with a uh, with a mag in it already. And then when they grabbed me my box, it had another mag in there. You can see I didn't do the best job painting my mags. I got some running there, but it is what it is. I'm not too worried about it. It puts the paint on the rifle. And, uh, yeah, I think I think you should definitely paint your rifles, whether you want to get it professionally done or whatever. Do, make it yours. Do, 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 some, do some work to it. You know, you're not in the military. Most military units don't allow painting of your rifles. Some do, but uh, you're not, uh, unless you unless you are. But when you're talking about your personal guns, paint them, man. Make them your own. Make them, make them camouflage. Make them wild, ridiculous colors. Do what you like. Do whatever suits you. Do you, boo boo. But uh, anyway, I'm just trying to keep this as as close to an M16A4 as I can. I know. Look at this. I duct taped a uh, pen light to the to the front cuz it's better than nothing. And I can't afford a uh, a proper weapon light right now. So if there's a critter in the backyard, uh that's going to have to do. Um this is not my bump in the night gun. I have I have a Glock 19 with a uh TLR on the bottom of it, which I I I like a lot. Um that would be my bump in the night gun. This is more like coyote in the backyard gun. Anywho, I'm not going to uh, take up a whole bunch of your time. Uh, just mentioning a few things. It's got the chrome line barrel. You got a M16 bolt carrier. It comes with the Delta, ri uh, Delta ring on there. Non-free floated. Pretty much a basic bare bones mil spec uh, M16 A4-ish build as, as close as we can really get. If that's what you want, and if you just if you just want an M16A4, just go out and buy a Wyndham Weaponry. You don't have to build one or do anything crazy. Th this is close enough for anything you're gonna need. Oh, one and seven twist barrel, just like the just like the military ones. Trying to think of anything I, I know about it off the top of my head. Uh, for YouTube purposes, this is a 29 round magazine. This is not a 30 round magazine because they they don't like that. So, you know, I haven't sold my AK. I still got that over here, the old uh, reliable AKM, the pirate style. Um, I put 22 on there because that's the that's the year that I bought it, 2022. 
That's the only reason for that. Nothing fancy. Anywho, I'm not going to keep you guys for a long time. We're already getting at a little over five minutes, and uh, that's that's long enough for me. I'm, I don't think I'm important enough to take up a whole lot of your time, so I'm going to let you guys get on. Really appreciate the view. If you want to see more like this, subscribe. If you want to support the Second, Amen uh, Second Amendment community, go ahead and hit that like button because you know they're trying to hold us down. That's just always been a thing, and Elon Musk is helping to prove that. Um. Yeah, shout out, shout out to Elon. Hell yeah, man. But uh, yeah, like I said, thank you guys so much for watching. Till the next time, I'm out.